Hi students, welcome to my channel CSI Tutorials by Kanyakumari. Uh, now we are going to discuss one important concept that is eight twins problem. So which uses the algorithm design approach that is backtracking in the subject design and analysis of algorithms. So so many students are asking so to do video on this eight twins problem. So uh, I'm doing this one. So this is very important concept eight twins problem. Okay. So to understand this, so if you understand this problem, that is a four twins problem, then it is easy to understand uh, this eight twins problem. Okay. You know already what is the meaning of uh, backtracking. Backtracking is nothing but, for example, uh, here there is a road, okay, a person is walking, walking in the road and this is dead end, you reach to that person, reach to dead end, then what this person has to do, compulsory has to move back, why, because he can't go, he or she can't go, this is called as dead end, so there is a uh, no possibility of getting a solution for the problem if you have chosen this possibility okay so that's why compulsory that person should move back so that is the concept of backtracking okay so now what is this uh, twins problem four twins problem eight twins problem so uh, four twins problem is nothing but uh, four twins are there like uh, like Take the, some chess board. Four coins are there. Four coins here are nothing but four coins are there. Here eight coins are nothing but eight coins are there like that. Okay. So four coins are there. You can take like a Q1, Q2, Q3, Q4. The constraint here it is uh, no two coins should present in the same row, same column, same diagonal. Okay. So that means uh, for example if this is the case. Uh, here four twins problem is here I am taking four by four chess board. Four by four chess board. Okay. So now four by four here it is. And now I am taking four rows and uh, four columns. So what is this uh, four twins problem? So we have to place the coins or the queens. Uh, okay. First queen we had to place in first row only. First queen we had to place in the first row only. But maybe in uh, any any columns 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay? In such a way that uh, no other queen is present in the same column or uh, same diagonal. Okay? So now for example, here I am placing first queen in first row. Generally what we will do? This is only the procedure now. So generally, this is some logical question. Don't think otherwise. Uh, so there is a something uh, big in it. Okay. So it is very simple. So Q1, here you have placed next. Uh, second queen. Second queen we have to place in second row. We can't place here. Why? Because you are getting uh, two queens in the same column. Here you can't place. Why? Because uh, you are getting same diagonal. So you can place Q2 here. Next, coming to Q3. So Q3 means here you can't place. Here you can't place. Why? Because the same diagonal. Here same column. So here again same diagonal. So that means you are unable to place a third queen. What does it mean? What it shows? So as you, are, you reach to dead end, there is no possibility of a placing third queen. So what we have to do is we have to move back so second queen so you try to move second queen back that means what we will do here it is so now what is going to happen now take again a four by four chess board one two three four one two three four first queen is here only suppose now that means here you are unable to Insert a third queen in third row means it is a wrong place. That's why we will change. So backtracking here, here it is nothing but here you can't place it. So backtracking here it is nothing but so some third queen to you have to move back to 
second winner check check back okay that means this is not the right position for example q2 here you have placed if q2 is placed here shall we place q3 here yeah q3 here we can place so here this is not the same diagonal this is not the same diagonal okay so now where can you place q4 you can place q4 here you can place q4 here why because same diagonal you can place q4 here you can place q4 here why because here it is again same diagonal so that means q3 place is wronger q3 place uh, how did you get this q3 place that is based on q2 but q2 all the possibilities already you have checked again backtrack that means here there is a wrong in the q1 position that means first queen we should not place in the first column so take another possibility so that means the first queen we will place in the what is a, another possibility so another possibility is in second second column so here q1 here we are placing if q1 is placed here you can place here q2 you can place here q2 you can place here q2 we can place q2 here now where can you place q3 uh q3 uh you here you can place why because it is not on the same diagonal q4 here you can place here you can place i think see this is the diagonal you can place here that's all so now the final solution here it is 2 4 1 3 that means the first queen is in second column so second queen is in fourth column third queen is in the first column fourth queen is in the third column okay so if you understand this concept this four queens problem it is easy to understand eight queens problem so now in the same manner here also we will start from the first place so that means the first queen we will place in the first column if it works so then we will move to second queen like that we can try for the solution so now a queens is nothing but here uh, what we have to consider is eight queens means eight by eight chess board we have to consider we have to consider 8 by 8 chess board so in the chess board here we will place one by one first queen second queen like that we will place it okay so now 8 by 8 chess board this all things here you have to explain in your exams okay so from 2 3 4 5 Six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. So now. Now how can we start the solution? This uh, in exams here you have to write the step by step procedure. Okay. So now here you have to place as usual first queen here we will place. Okay. Second queen we can't place here. So second queen you can place here. Then third queen we can't place here. So third queen here you can place. Fourth queen here you can't place. See the diagonals. Those are important. Huh? Okay, check that once. So Q three here you can't place. So Q four here you can place. Next to Q five here you can't place. Uh, Q five. See here you can't place. Q five here you can't place. Here you can't place. Here you can't place. Uh, then here you can place a Q five. Okay. So now we will check one by one now. So suppose Q five is placed here, then is it coming to any diagonal? No, Q five here you can place. Then Q six in sixth row. This is one, two, three, four, 
8 by 8 just put na 6th row so here you can place here you can place here you can place uh, q6 here um, see this one here so, yeah now for example q6 here you are placing uh, then it is great now check the diagram yeah it is okay now q7 here you can place here you can place here you can place here you can you here you can q7 is it possible to place q7 yeah q7 here you can place now you check is it coming the same diagonal no this is not in the same diagonal here yeah. now check this also the possibilities so why because diagonals here you have to check up very clearly q8 here you can place here you can place all these q8 if we place q8 now see what is going to happen now this is wrong solution same uh, two queens you are getting in the same column so that means backtrack that means you are not getting the solution or you are not getting the space to insert eighth queen that means check your seventh queen so seventh queen where can you place you can't place here can you place here q7 check this for example see here also you can't place you check all these possibilities so that means for q7 also you are not getting it. so that means again move back up so now check q6 here so this is not the right place why because if you place q6 here now q7 place you are not getting q8 place you are not getting suppose q6 this you can't place okay q7 here already you have uh, yeah this we can't check now see here uh, shall we place q6 here you can't place shall we place q6 here uh, this is okay now see this is not okay so that means so q6 also you are not getting means this is not the right solution q5 so then check a q5 In here you can't place q5 now so here you can place q5 like that all the possibilities you have to verify uh, one of the solution for this a queen's problem here it is so first queen is placed in fourth column that means one two three four here okay fourth column second queen is placed in sixth column third queen is placed in eighth column fourth queen is placed in second seventh first q1 q2 q3 q4 q5 Sixth queen is placed in first column. Seventh queen is placed in the third column. Eighth queen is placed in the fifth column. Okay, Q1, Q2. This is one of the solution. You know, so in backtracking concept, we, we may have more than one solution. May have one solution. This is one of the solutions. That's it. Okay. So here, uh, how can you check uh, same diagonal? So the same one condition is there to check whether uh, the queen is placing in the same diagonal. Okay. For example, I, J, I throw J -th column is one position. Then K throw L -th column is in another position. For example, this is. Uh, ij position this is kl position for example now actually these two are in the same diagonal okay how can we check in the algorithm so uh, here see what is the place here um, second row 1 2 3 4 5 6 this is 2 6 kl means 3 7 if you observe the difference so only one difference you are getting in between these two this diagonal suppose this is 3 7 now what is this one this is 4 comma 8 so 3 7 4 8 only one difference between the row number and column numbers for diagonal positions okay so here the condition here it is whenever uh, you are inserting like i minus j if it is equal to k minus l 
okay so i may and sj here what is the difference between these two four what is the difference between four that means there may be a chance of the elements or the coins in the same diagonal now check this one also the difference between this so this is nothing but j minus l equal to i minus k so that may be positive or negative but magnitude is the same then you can take it as absolute of so if these are the possibilities then you can say that uh, two queens are in the same diagonal you can't place you can't place that queen in that diagonal okay so all this explanation you have to mention so this is simply a queen's problem a queen's problem uses uh, the important things here are uh, uh, a queen's problem uses a backtracking concept and a queen's problem is 8 by 8 chess board we had to place 8 queens in such a way that uh, so 2 queens should not present in the same row column and diagonal hope you understand students thank you if you understand this please share with your friends okay thank you students have a great day bye